Hello there, free and easy. We are looking for the one that calls himself Ben. We do not know what Ben stands for, but we're pretty sure it's butterflies, elephants, Nutella. Ben, if that is your real name, you have recently been contacted by a certain individual named Jake Walters for the application of group leader. Here at Anonymous, we would like to tell you why we think Jake would be a great addition to your free and easy family. His passion for making good times, great times, have always been one of his more likable attributes. Always willing to do whatever it takes to put a smile on somebody's face. Bringing out the best in the most stubborn of people. During his own travels, he's come to realize that it's not about where you travel, but who you travel with that makes the experience. Building relationships with the people you travel with will determine your travel experience. Jake brings a genuine interest in getting to know the people he travels with to really get a sense of what would make that experience that much better for everybody. Oh yeah! You can't be talking about Jake Walters without mentioning his energy, his creativity, his excitement, and his enthusiasm! Fucking El Hombre. Which one's mine? Bring the speakers! The one, I'm Hi! You're yeah, a stand-up guy willing to make you laugh your pants off if need be! This is it. Willing to set it off at any moment's notice. Macho Man Jake Savage would love to join the Free and Easy family. First off, I'd like to take uh, the time to say thank you for watching my video. Um, uh, there are a few other things I'd like to talk about in a more serious tone than Macho Man, Randy Savage. I got qualities as a person, as a traveler, that I think would be beneficial to a free and easy group leader. I'm a listener. You know, I, I, I think one thing that people don't do enough is listen. And if you're trying to manage uh, a group of people and try and give them the best uh, personal experience as possible, what, like, what's not better than listening to them and finding out what those things are? As a group leader trying to manage and gauge a person's travel experience, I'm, well, like communication is key. That's it's got to be there between the leaders and the members, and I think I, I have that quality. As far as uh, experience for leadership, um, I got experience in party planning, promoting, event planning. So, organization of chaos is something I've dealt with. You know, not everything always goes according to plan, and uh, if you are able to manage and find a solution properly then a lot of times people don't even know there was a problem in the first place and so I think that's a good skill to have if you need to be managing a group of people I'm not gonna sit here and say I'm perfect I have my faults too uh, I can't grow a beard and I love 90s boy band music but hey nobody's perfect dude who puts a beard on for a job interview this guy